I'm a retired Border Patrol officer. My main job was understanding and having intelligence capabilities about drug smuggling across the U.S. border and human smuggling across the U.S. border to bring contraband and people into the United States. That's what I did for 26 years. National security is a component of the immigration laws and the reason that immigration officers exist because the immigration laws are designed to primarily do just two things, protect national security and public safety. The component of national security is the economy and American jobs because the foundation of American society, which is the family unit, depends on jobs and the economy for their livelihood. On the other side is the public safety, which includes public health, and that is so the people will be secure in their persons and their property from outside source threats. In other words, people coming in to take over America by force or by subterfuge. Right now, Department of Homeland Security is in charge of, through Customs and Border Protection, the apprehension and collection of the illegal aliens. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention is in charge of the screening with the U.S. Public Health Service. I've never seen the CDC or U.S. Public Health Service work together with the Border Patrol at the border, ever. The agents are telling us that they're seeing some people that are obviously sick uh, with shivering type illnesses, uh, with possibly uh, uh, dehydrating illnesses like diarrhea and vomiting. But those people are disappearing. We don't know what they have, where they're going, where they're taking them. Surely they, they're being quarantined somewhere. We just don't know where. And even the agents don't know what the uh, diagnosis is of the here, heaving the body of one victim, still highly contagious, into a flatbed truck piled high with others, immediately afterwards spraying him down with bleach. Patients through the window, watching it all. This is incredible. You know, seeing a truck cart away 10 bodies of people who, who died from Ebola, I can't imagine what someone is thinking who, who has arrived there for, for treatment. smuggling across the U.S. border and human smuggling across the U.S. border to bring contraband and people into the United States. That's what I did for 26 years. National security is a component of the immigration laws and the reason that immigration officers exist.